city in the south of Brazil has been awarded for the past three decades for being a great sustainable city. Curitiba, Brazil has a population of around 3 million people and a recent survey shows that the people are happy with their city. Curitiba is a city in a developing country which has created a better environment and quality of life for every citizen. All started with one man and one simple idea, prioritizing people. Jamie Lerner was an aspiring student of architecture and urban planning, and he became major in the early 70s. When he took office, he had a plan to demolish all buildings and wide the main city street because of the intense traffic. Since 1971, Jamie Lerner has been the city major and governor of the state for a total of 22 years, and now he's a legend. That they are becoming important for the future of the society. One is mobility. The second is sustainability. And the third is identity. So Lerner created an axis of traffic paths, each with three roads, one leading into the city, one out, and a central road with two-way traffic and a dedicated bus-only lane to speed passengers in and out of the center. Lerner introduced a triple articulated buses to carry even 250 passengers, and the cost, according to Lerner, is 200 times less than a subway. The people board into three different doors of the bus simultaneously, so the unloading and loading is very fast. The bus system in Curitiba is so successful that it's used by 85% of the population and it's been an inspiration to many other cities around the world. Thinking about his buses, one day Lerner realized that they were slow by boarding time with people buying their tickets on the bus. So he came up with a design and that was the final touch, the glass boarding tubes. Now, during peak hours, buses arrive every 60 seconds and they are always full. The city of Curitiba has used their bus rapid transit system to help shape their city with a transit-oriented development along the express bus lines. They have around 1,100 buses that make 12,000 trips every day and these are operated by private bus companies of all who make a profit on their operations.